today's video, I'm going to be trying some of the new secrets in the Brookhaven Winter Update. If you want to see more Brookhaven Hacks videos, make sure to hit that thumbs up. I want to see at least 2,000 likes on this video. And if you want to keep up with all the juicy secrets in Brookhaven, make sure to hit that subscribe button and become a rad tad. I cover as many Brookhaven Hacks as I possibly can. Oh no, looks like someone's after me. All right, let's hurry and get into the video. Ah! All right, as we can see, I am on a public Brookhaven server because it looks like the new hacks are going to need some other people to help me. And since I don't have Riley here with me, I am going to get the help of all of the cool players of Brookhaven. So the first hack we're going to be looking at, we have to start by grabbing the bubble gum from the ice cream shop. The next step is we have to find someone to give the ice cream to. So let's see if one of these girls will take the ice cream. Cream. All right, I've got to get this out of my hand here. Let's see if she'll take it. Hey, uh, I know you guys are role playing, but I need to figure out this hack. Take my ice cream. All right, I'm going to give the ice cream to everyone until someone takes it. Take my ice cream. Take it. Take the ice cream. Why does no one want the ice cream? Come on, guys. They're too busy about arguing about this person being a faker or whatever. I don't really know what's going on. Maybe these people over here will take my ice cream. Hi, you also have the name Sam. Will you take my ice cream? Oh, he's gone. Okay, well, bye, Sam. Sam 2.0. Hey, you, mister, who's running to get in a car. Will you take my ice cream? Oh, uh, hello? Oh, bye. Uh, what? Did he just like outfit quick change? What just happened? Okay, maybe this daycare worker will take it. Here, take my ice cream. Someone take the dang ice cream, please. Someone, please take this ice cream. Please, I need it so desperately. Someone take it, take it. Take it basketball man. He said, okay, he took my ice cream, come on. I'm giving it to you. I'm giving it to you, please. Just take it, just take it. Here, take it. Okay, why? For a hack. Please, please. Oh, he said, okay, okay, take it. I need you to take the ice cream. Yes, he took the ice cream. Thank you so much, friend. All right, now I have to look at the Maya and Claire video to see what the other new hack is. Are those bodies? I'm not gonna, I don't wanna know. Back back to the hack. Okay, next we have to spawn in a house. So uh, not an apartment, we gotta get a house lot. So let's see, uh, house 17 is available. So the house that you need to get is the tree house. And as you can see, the border on it is already broken, which means that maybe there really is a hack going on here. Cause there's usually a white border around the house, but it looks like all of the detail has been taken out of it. All right, now that we're in the house, Time for the next step. Okay, now that we're in the house, everybody, we're gonna go upstairs and we've gotta click the fireplace three times. One, two, and three. All right, we've activated it three times. Let's see if anything happens. All right, let's go ahead and take a look around, see if anything's happening. Uh, I don't think, I think that's all that happens in the tree house. But next, it's a perfect thing that we put this house right next to the church because the next part of the hack is actually inside. And it's already set up for a funeral, which is perfect. So all we have to do is put the letters W-E-L, well. And now there should be a mystery painting under here. Oh my gosh, it worked! Look at that, guys! I put it, I'm in the coffin, and now I can see the secret photo. So this hack worked! Okay, the next place that we have to go is to the hill by the motel, and there might be a way that we can put a sleeping bag to glitch into a new secret spot. Man, I can't wait to try out this hack. Okay, so it looks like the hill over here by the motel, if we go beside the road, it looks like we can put a sleeping bag right here. All right, let's hop inside and see what happens. All right, now that I'm in here, oh my gosh, you can see completely into the Brookhaven area back there. Okay, let's see, maybe, maybe can I? Oh my gosh, guys, I have almost got myself into this secret area. It looks like I need to try and put things down a little bit more. I might be glitched in here, but you can see everything on the bottom of the 
Brookhaven map. And there looks like a secret room down here. Guys, we could figure out so many things by getting in here. Okay, I'm gonna reset and I'm gonna try again. Oh, it tossed me out of the wall. It definitely knows I'm trying to break in. Okay, but it's just over there. It's not a far, far shot from the spawn area. So we're gonna try it one more time and see if there's anything hidden down in this area. I am so sure that the devs are certainly hiding something over here. Okay, I'm down lower this time. <gasps> I made it, I made it into the secret space. Okay, I have to be careful though, because if I fall, I'm just going to die. So let's see if there are any hidden messages or anything. Now that is a, a space I don't know about. And this looks like it's some kind of secret room. Oh my gosh, this means that there have to be more hacks coming in future updates to Brookhaven or there are ones that haven't been discovered yet. All right, well, let's keep trying these hacks because two have been a success. All right, for this next hack, we're gonna be going back to the motel. We need to get room number four and kick back on the couch. All right, I've unlocked it. Now we're going to kick back. And the next step is that you have to get rid of your home. <gasps> Whoa, look, now I'm like super glitched in here. This is so cool. Apparently, once you get into the rooms when they are unclaimed, you're supposed to see something creepy. Now, because I'm on a public server, it may not work, but we're gonna check all the rooms beforehand. I mean, I think the weird thing about this one is the way that you walk. But guys, I think that this myth is a bust. I haven't seen anything creepy since I got back here. And you know that I only do the best of hacks. There is a little bit of light over here, but I think that's from the area behind the hotel. So I'm gonna say that this myth is a bust. On to the next one. The next hack that we are going to try requires you to go to lot 14 and get one of the OG houses. Okay, it's gotta be the house that is right here, right below the frat house, this one. All right, now that we've spawned the house in, we have to go inside and upstairs to sit in a very specific chair. Now let's find it. It has to be in the corner up here somewhere in this chair, perfect. Okay, now that I'm seated, I have to zoom in to first person, hop out, and then looks like I have to go in here and look at this wall. Oh my gosh, guys, did you, did you see that? Okay, all right, you know what? I was really excited to try out these new hacks in Brookhaven, you guys, and I even did it on a public server, and I wanted to show everyone, but I think maybe, just maybe, this is too creepy. Even for me, the most goaded at Roblox. That's right, guys, I'm gonna call it here, but make sure you leave a like if you wanna see more Brookhaven secret videos.